What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Dermy Wormy and I got a, sp a revisiting a topic for you guys and everything. I did a video on this just the other day in regards to Screen Rant talking about these uh, particular numbers and we'll hop right on over here to tell you what what exactly I'm talking about. You know, the, the whole numbers from Screen Rant trying to paint the anniversary, spe uh, not the anniversary special, but the Christmas special. First outing for Shuti Gatwa, the man who uh, openly bragged about getting snowmaned within the uh, Christmas special, you know, show made for kids, uh, pointing out a very, very, very raunchy and disgusting sexual act between two men. Yeah, remember that. That is an actual line in the show. Well, I, I talked about the screen ramp, but I always want to remind you guys the Christmas special still has yet to put out its consolidated viewership. I've heard numbers here or there. I'm not going to trust them until I see it from the horse's mouth. And even then, I'm going to question it because it's starting to look like it's going to go two weeks without ever seeing these numbers. Yeah, the numbers that came were supposed to be out, you know, from a show from Christmas. Yeah, I still don't have them. Well, in this particular Screen Rant article, they reference the Radio Times in an article from the Radio Times where they start talking about numbers and stuff and it just wasn't adding up. Well, actually, I actually went to the Radio Times and found the article. Now, the article isn't even that good and is still misleading you on purpose. It is still just another example of mis the media outright misleading you and trying to say that something is good when in reality it's not. But let's read this, shall we? <clears throat> Doctor Who was streamed 10 million times on iPlayer over Christmas. Now, first time you hear that, what are you thinking? Oh my God, that means the special was streamed 10 million times on iPlayer over Christmas. Oh my God. Oh, no. No, because the reality is the BBC has revealed, released the viewing figures for Doctor Who over the festive period and has revealed the sci-fi show from 2005 onwards was watched a whopping 10.1 oh, 10 million times. They are outright categorizing it from on the iPlayer, the iPlayer, okay? During a two-week period, period because that's what a fortnight is that is two weeks okay not what they're gonna say with the uh radio times saying that it's so it was just one week no a fortnight is two weeks okay so over a two-week period the entirety of new who the entirety of it was streamed 10.01 million times but then on top of that you also have to take into account account how the iPlayer works every view every time you click on it once you get a minute to two minutes in it's one of the two I've heard various uh, anecdotes I've always been told it's a minute somebody told me it was two minutes the other day when you get to a minute to two minutes in that's one view so so every minute essentially every minute to two minutes you could you know stop it walk away come back get another two minutes done and to do the same thing. And guess what? That's two to three, three views. One person can be multiple views, multiple streams, multiple, all that. So already being on 10.01 million, isn't really that great because it doesn't even break down the accounts. Doesn't break down the actual individuals. All it says was, Hey, it was streamed this many times guys over the entirety of the series was streamed this many times on the iPlayer. Not, not just that episode. The entire series. Yeah, yeah, that, that, that's great. During the Christmas week, 25th December to 31st December, viewers all flocked to iPlayer and set a new all-time record according to the BBC. The Doctor Who Christmas special, The Church on Ruby Road, was the fourth watched series throughout the BBC's festive fortnight. So the most, the fourth, no, fifth, the fifth, Fifth most watched series over the past two weeks. Wow, that number five. Hey guys, we're number five over two weeks. We're number five. What were your competition? Seriously, I'm curious. What was your competition over those five weeks? You were viewed five times. How many people actually viewed you? This this is starting to get now questionable on how does the iPlayer track this? Because again, one view, one one person can be 
basically in regards to uh the church on ruby road it was a 46 minute episode so one person can technically be 46 views remember that one person can be 46 views watch it watch it for a minute stop it walk away come back so you always have to take that into account so okay even with that you were the fifth what was better than you Oh, I, I, I'm really curious. But again, it's also over a fortnight, which was two weeks. So you were only five over two weeks, not even a one week. Oh, that, that's great. It received 1.7 million, 79 million streams. Again, don't know how much I can trust that over the festive period, which saw the first full episode of Shooty Gatwa as the doctor, as he met his companion, Ruby Sunday, Millie Gibson. Uh, yeah, you just gotta love it. But you get come down here. Dan McGoplin, director of BBC iPlayer and channel, said it's wonderful to see that viewers came to BBC iPlayer in record numbers over the festive period. Although, again, like I've already pointed out, we don't know how many people actually viewed this. We only get their numbers, and I've already pointed out the problem with their numbers. So, uh, take that. Nowhere else would they have found the same range of high-quality British programming to keep them gripped, make them laugh, or to provide companionship and news at the special time. At that special time, well, l l let me be fair here. Let me be fair. They probably did watch a lot of Doctor Who during that time, mainly because Doctor Who Christmas specials were very British and were actually a very poignant point in uh british culture so much so that uh they're probably going back there and watching all the good versions of uh the doctor who christmas specials you know ranging from christmas invasion uh voyage to the damned uh what, what's another one actually uh a, a christmas carol all these wonderful examples of good doctor who christmas specials and probably only watched uh, shooty got was a handful of time because even when you take into the account what they're saying the whole thing was viewed about 10 million, uh, 10.01 million times. And you have to take out at least 1.79 million times of that. That's still about nine to 8 million, uh, streams that weren't watching that. So good for you. Good, good for you. Yeah. They, they didn't care. And with a whole host of compelling drama, comedy, fra factual programming, entertainment, and sport landing on iPlayer in 2024, Viewers can look forward to a great year ahead. Uh, defund the BBC because, again, the iPlayer cannot be trusted with its analytics, essentially. The, that, that's what this all breaks down to. But furthermore, my buddy, the Hollywood scholar, had an interesting uh, a bit of math that he broke down. Come over here to Twatters. Uh, Hollywood scholar. Wow. Nearly 200 episodes had 10 million streams over the festive fortnight period. Two weeks. Yes. Two weeks, not seven days, as Radio Time says. That's right. A fortnight is two weeks. So, nearly 200 episodes had 10 million streams. I, I, I want you guys to realize that. Nearly 200 episodes of Doctor Who had 10 million streams. An hour apiece. Yeah, that's not, that, that, that's not good. That's actually really crap over two weeks yeah yeah if 666 million 666 thousand 666 people streamed only the 15 christmas specials including unquiet dead unquite dead they could have got that yeah yeah that's all they had to do now in a country of 70 million they can't obviously prove that but at the same time uh, there's other little key bits and factors to take into account on how the iPlayer works and stuff. You know, some uh, stuff that we can't quite uh, say so aloud on YouTube. <coughs> Illegal paint. <coughs> VPN. <coughs> ah, to get that viewership. So again, even that doesn't help. This, this, we don't even know how these numbers are gathered. We don't know what's going on here. But again, 200 episodes were watched 10 million times in two weeks in a country of 70 million people. And also, that's just maybe the 70 million people. I do have to be honest there. So, uh, yeah, it wasn't this great grand win that they thought it was. It was actually something quite pathetic and weak. A show that at one point in time boasted all these numbers, all this wonderful stuff. 
uh, it, it's pathetic and sad now. So it begs the question, what else were they watching if only 1.79 million times they watched the Shooty Gatwa episode? They were all probably watching the better iterations of the Christmas special. Just going to be honest there. But let me get you guys' thoughts on all this down in the comments below. What are your thoughts on the dwindling desperation of uh, uh, Doctor Who and how they have to just work so hard to spin these numbers in their favor? And until next time, guys, bye for now.